Today in our 2016 Ford Focus, we're going to take a look at the best roof rack options available. Now when searching for roof rack systems, these are going to be the top three choices from each of these different manufacturers. Up at the top, we have our Rhinorack RS Series roof rack system. Here we have our Inno Square Bar roof rack system. And at the bottom, we have our Yakima Jetstream Bar roof rack system. Now each of these three roof rack systems has their advantages, but let's go ahead and take a look at the differences between these roof racks. Now the most obvious difference between these three racks is going to be with our middle rack, the Inno, which has a square bar as opposed to the aero bars or vortex aero bars of the Rhino Rack or the Yakima. Now while the square bar isn't going to necessarily cut down wind noise and drag, you can purchase separately fairings that will do that for this system. With both of our aero bars, the Rhino Rack and the Yakima, we do have this rubber strip on the tops of both of them. Now this does provide an advantage as you can use T-Track accessories with both of these roof racks. However, with Yakima, instead of having to remove the rubber strip in the center to place your items in and then cutting it to length to go around it, you simply push it down and slide your T-Track accessory through without having to make any cuts. Here's the Vortex Aero Strip on our Rhino Rack that I had mentioned. You do have to remove this to install your T-Track accessory and then you would cut it to length and put it around the T-Track accessory to continue using your Vortex Aero Strip. Now out of these three bars, both the Rhino Rack and the Inno do come with locks installed on our end caps already. So once you install this onto your roof, it's gonna be secure to your roof. Now the Yakima rack does provide a knockout for it, but you do have to purchase the locks separately. Now with our Yakima and our Inno racks, you're gonna see that we have crossbar overhang on both of those. However, with the Rhino rack, it does cut off right where the legs come up. That's gonna give the roof rack kind of a factory style look to it. Also with the Rhino racks, you're gonna have these stickers here to let you know it's the FL or front left and front right, as well as for the rear bars. And one last note about our Rhinorack RS system here is that the leg as well as the bars are already assembled once you get them. And as opposed to the Inno and the Yakima, which you do have to spend a little bit of time with assembly. The only thing you have to put on with the Rhinorack is gonna be the rubber pad here and the clamp for the front and the rear. When it comes to carrying capacities, the Rhinorack is gonna have 165 pounds, the Inno is gonna have 120 pounds, and the Yakima is also gonna have 165 pounds. Now you always wanna double check with your vehicle's manual though to make sure that your roof can withstand that weight. In conclusion, as far as aerodynamics and weight capacity, the Rhino Rack and the Yakima are pretty much gonna be dead even. However, as far as ease of installation is concerned, the Rhino Rack is gonna have a little bit of a head start as it's already partially put together once you have it. And we hope this makes your buying decision easier for your Ford Focus. Click the link below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com.